If you listened to the West Stand on Friday, he is the reason Saints are top of the league this season. Although loving the lyrics, Lachlan Coote is quick to pay tribute the overall team effort that has allowed him to slot seamlessly into his new colors. The former North Queensland Cowboys fullback has grown with each game in the Red B, with his string pulling in attack and marshalling of the defense being a key components of the team's success. And the fans have warmed to him, culminating in a two-hour rendition of his own personalized anthem. Coote said, it was pretty loud on Friday. I have never experienced anything like that and I am sure it is going to be the same at Wigan on Friday. I had a lot of people messaging me on social media telling me that there was a new song about me, and then I could not get it out of my head after Friday night given the number of times I heard it. It has been overwhelming the amount of support the St. Helens fans have shown me. I got a bit emotional on Friday night with it all. It is a lot different to us, it has exceeded my expectations, it has been awesome. Hopefully, we don't have to change those lyrics, and we stay top of the league all season. Having made his Saints debut against Wigan in the Super League launch, he already knows what the derby is about, but he has already been warned that the intensity on the pitch goes up a notch and the volume off rises by a few decibels. The last time against Wigan it was really physical and fast, but because it was the first game of the year I was cramping up. It was up there with one of the toughest games I have played and I don't expect Good Friday to be any different. Everyone is match fit now, he said. Saints Cup date and time confirmed greater than he will be facing former England fullback Zach Hardiker. Could expects plenty of threat from the one-time Steve Prescott man of steel. He said, Hardiker has done some great things in the past and is still doing them now. He is a good runner with a good pass and a kicking game as well. He is one that we have definitely got to watch out for on Friday. He will, however, be focusing on his own game, one that is benefiting from the work of those in front of him. Although Coot is getting the musical plaudits, the 29-year-old is quick to pay tribute to the path that has laid such a tremendous platform for him to work off so far this season. Coot said, the Saints pack has been awesome, running out the back of them has made my job a lot easier. They have been tremendous for us coming out of yardage and the amount of work they are doing in good ball has been great. Watching Tom O from the back I don't know how he does it. He is unbelievable in what he is doing. And in terms of helping to marshal the team, Coot has had to take a bit more responsibility in recent weeks with the Ophages being out injured, compounded by Johnny Lomax's sickness in France. That led to Saints only defeat of the campaign so far, in a tight game at a brain lashed stayed Brutus. It was tough in Catalans, with two young halves with Danny being out for a while and finding his way back in. On top of that the conditions could not have been any worse. To be fair the way Danny responded on Friday night against Warrington was awesome, his defense was good and the way he ran the forwards and led the team was good. He has not come into the team to try and overdo things. He is doing his job and it is a credit to him for that, he said. But going back to the lyrics of this song, setting up Tommy and Regan, Coot reckons the team is blessed with two brilliant finishers that are joy to help create space for. Regan has got some real pace, Tommy is quick too, and that is what I love about having two wingers like that. With Regan, give him space and he will make you pay and that is what he did against Warrington. Read, Saints name 19 man for Wigan greater than, and we have been working on the right hand side that, but it has not gone that way much over the first 10 rounds. But on the weekend Kevin, Nakama, really stepped up and that was one of his best games of the year. It is the same with Tommy Mock. He has been awesome all year with the amount of carries he is doing and the amount of work he gets through is unreal, Coot said. Let's block ads. Why? 